And you want to make sure that your shoulder is dropped down as you're pulling across. Okay, so that's number one. Cool. Now the one behind you. So you're pulling your hand all the way to your opposite hip. Okay, as you get in the stretch. Now you lift your sternum up and pull your shoulder back. All right, so it's all about when you lift your sternum up, you'll feel a, a bigger stretch. Okay? And then you transition into your trap stretch. So now you just have your arm nice and long. All right, pulling down to the side. Cool. And then you tilt your head. So that is number three. Cool? All right. Shoulder blade is retracted, and you're pinning your shoulder with your chin. And your elbow is going to be 45 degrees to your body. So when you're ready, once you get to that uh, 6 or a 7 out of 10 on that stretch scale, you gently push that hand into your top hand for 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Exhale and lower your hand even more. So things to remember with this stretch, you always want to make sure that your shoulder blade is back and retracted. Right. Right? Uh -huh. And you pin your shoulder down with your chin.